Hello guys, this is MTND and I'm back with an update on my Ender Pearl Cannon that is a bit tricky to use, as you know, you have to align your cursor perfectly at the edge of that torch and if you do that it can be a very convenient tool to travel for a thousand blocks because we are now in the nether, you can see that we traveled 400 blocks but when we uh, transfer this to the overworld it will be 3200 blocks about a week ago Sark uploaded a video where he suggested to use the chunk loaders for the entities and that means that we can use the enderpole cannons to travel infinite amount of blocks where we have the chunk loaders the only factor that limits our distance is the amount of TNT that we use right here I'm using six dispensers that launched the prime TNT so I travel 400 blocks but if I increase the amount of uh, dispensers I can travel further this is the new type of my cannon I'm using a bit more compact wiring over here with the redstone comparators for the delay and because I increased the amount of dispensers I had to rewire this part but I don't have the problem that Sark had uh, the Sark could not launch the Ender Pearl in a straight way towards, but when I align myself in this cannon like that and uh, place the cursor at the edge of the torch and hold the right mouse button, I can fly right to the portal out there. So you can technically make uh, another cannon like that on the place where the portal is situated to travel between the cannons using them but but you will have to uh, add another hopper like that over here so the chunks will load each other but I'm using one way cannon here so I'm using only one hopper in one chunk I will include uh, this world in the description and you can test it out and try it for yourself so that's about it and thanks for watching